In this lecture, we will do practice problems on Bayer Villager oxidation. Before going through this, I would suggest you to watch the lecture on Bayer Villager oxidation. This ketone in the presence of metachloroperoxy benzoic acid undergoes Bayer Villager oxidation. The cyclic ring will migrate in preference to methyl group, so that oxygen is inserted here to from this ester. Under basic conditions of lithium hydroxide, or any other hydroxide like NaOH, KOH, hydrolysis of ester takes place to form this alcohol and acetic acid. Similarly in case of this norbornone, the reagent MCPBA will bring about the Bayer Villager rearrangement. Among the bridgehead carbon and methylene carbon, bridgehead carbon will preferentially migrate to oxygen to form lactone on bridgehead side. This under the basic KOH conditions will hydrolyze to form alcohol and acid, both attached to cyclic ring. This cyclopentanone in the presence of hydrogen peroxide undergoes Bayer Villager oxidation to form this lactone. The ketone is symmetrical, so methylene migration to oxygen on either side will form the same lactone. Esters when reduced with lithium aluminium hydride followed by hydrolysis give alcohol. The bacteria strain variants which produce Bayer Villager monooxygenase, abbreviated as BVMO, can be employed in Bayer Villager oxidation. In this case, 3 phenylcyclobutanone in the presence of said bacteria strain is converted to lactone. The ketone is symmetrical and either methylene group can migrate to form the given lactone. The Bayer Villager oxidation of following paramethylbenzaldehyde with trifluoroperoxyacetic acid in dichloromethane results in formation of a formate for methylphenyl formate due to preferential migration of aryl group substituted by an electron donating methyl group. But it undergoes hydrolysis under the reaction conditions to yield a phenol for methylphenol. This reaction is similar to that of Dakin reaction. In this case, the carbonyl group is flanked by CH2 group on one side and CHCF3 group on other side. The presence of electron withdrawing CF3 group decreases the migratory aptitude of methylene. Thus under Bayer Villager conditions, CH2 group migrates in preference to CHCF3 group to form this lactone. Let us predict the major product when 2S3S23-dimethylcyclohexanone is treated with MCPBA. Four options are given here. The first thing to notice is the stereochemistry of the reactant which should be retained in Bayer Villager oxidation. Thus options C and D are nullified because stereochemistry is not retained. Option A and B shows retention of configuration. Out of these, option A shows migration of methylene in preference to more substituted carbon and an additional methylene between carbonyl and more substituted carbon. Therefore, it is also cancelled out. What is left is option B, which correctly shows the migration of more substituted carbon, with retention of stereochemistry in migrating group. Thus option B is the correct choice. Let us predict the major product formed when paramenthone is treated with Caro's acid, H2SO5, buffered with disodium hydrogen phosphate. Na2HPO4. Out of four options, option D can't be correct because of inversion in stereochemistry at para position. Therefore, it is cancelled. Option A shows migration of methylene compared to more substituted carbon. So it is also cancelled. Option B shows migration of more substituted carbon 
but position of this methyl substituent is change. So it is also cancelled out. Thus option C shows the correct product with migration of secondary ring carbon preferentially over the primary ring carbon, with retention of configuration in the migrating group, which clearly shows the concerted nature of rearrangement step. Thus option C shows the correct product with migration of more substituted carbon and retention of configuration. While predicting the major product formed in the Bayer Villager oxidation of this molecule with steroidal skeleton, one must be careful in noticing the stereochemistry of atoms groups given in reactant molecule and compare the same in the choices given. Remember, Bayer Villager rearrangement goes with retention of stereochemistry. Option B and option C shows inversion of stereochemistry for this hydrogen compared to that in reactant, therefore these two options are nullified. Option A and option D shows the retention of configuration. In option D, primary methylene carbon is shown migrated and therefore cancelled out. Option A shows the migration of secondary bridgehead carbon in preference to primary, which is the correct migratory aptitude. Thus option A is the correct answer. This ketone on treatment with Bayer-Villager monooxygenase will undergo Bayer-Villager oxidation. Option B and option D shows inversion of stereochemistry compared to that in reactant, therefore these two options are nullified. Option A and option C both shows the retention of configuration and migration of more substituted carbon. If we carefully examine option C, we can see the position of double bond is changed. Thus option C is cancelled out. Thus option A is the correct answer, with retention of configuration, migration of more substituted carbon and no change in position of double bond. Camphor on treatment with MCPBA and NAHCO3 undergoes Bayer-Villager oxidation. Since no stereochemistry is depicted in the reactant, so we don't have to bother about it. Out of the four options given, option B is cancelled out as it shows carbon replaced by oxygen which doesn't happen in Bayer-Villager oxidation. Option C shows migration of less substituted methylene, so it is cancelled out. Option A is the correct answer as it shows migration of tertiary bridgehead carbon. Option D is the hydrolysis product of option A, so if hydrolysis is shown as second step in reaction, then option D is to be chosen as answer. When this ketone is treated with trifluoroperoxyacetic acid, Bayer-Villager rearrangement takes place. Option A and B show the hydroxylated products, which doesn't take place under the given reaction conditions so these two options are cancelled out. Option C show migration of phenyl in preference to tertiary bridgehead carbon and is therefore cancelled out. Option D is correct as it shows migration of tertiary bridgehead carbon. When this ketone is treated with peroxy acid, Bayer-Villager oxidation takes place. The peroxy acid here is isotopically labeled. Therefore, the ester oxygen in the product must be this isotopically labeled oxygen. Options B and C don't have this labeled oxygen, so these two are cancelled out. Option D shows migration of methylene carbon and is therefore cancelled out. Option A is correct, as it shows migration of PHCH in preference to methylene carbon.